A Texas biomed researcher has spent 20 years helping to develop vaccines for therapies for Ebola, Marburg virus, and the anthrax plague. And now he's working to battle COVID-19, even helping develop the Pfizer and the Novavax vaccines. Courtney Freeman explains how he's now finding ways to block or treat this ever-changing variant. Alpha, Beta, Delta, Omicron, a lot of Americans are learning the Greek alphabet as the original SARS-CoV-2 virus that causes COVID-19 continues to mutate and cause new variants. But only those changes that confer some sort of advantage to a variant will will actually go out in the population. Dr. Ricardo Carrion Jr. is the director of maximum containment contract research at Texas Biomed in San Antonio. He says current COVID vaccines broadly cover the basic structure of SARS-CoV-2, and so far that's held for all the variants, just to different degrees. For example, he says you're less protected from the Omicron variant without a vaccine boost. We, we see that there's some evasion occurring and is also always possible. Which is why teams like his are working around the clock to update boosters and even create different types of vaccines. So that part of the vaccine that allows your body to respond, uh, they're looking at different areas that might be more protective against these variants that that emerge. Variants like Omicron have also changed the way they're developing therapies for people with COVID instead of just targeting one specific part of the original version of the virus. Partners are looking at different areas of Omicron and perhaps finding some sort of what we call pan uh, pan coronavirus type therapy. So you can look at all different coronavirus and hopefully one will be able to help counteract any future unseen variant. A constant work in progress impacting the future of mankind. Courtney Friedman, KSAT 12 News.